हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स यू ऑल आर वेलकम टू दिस वीडियो सब्जेक्ट सेशन ऑफ मैथ्स पर ऑन वर्क बुक पेज नंबर थर्टी वन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वन ऑफ द टॉपिक सो लेट्स रीड द टॉपिक एंड अंडरस्टैंड फर्स्ट व्हाट वी नीड टू डू इन दिस टॉपिक इज दैट मेजर्ड द एंगल्स गिवन बिलो स्टूडेंट्स हेयर आर सम एंगल्स गिवन आई टोल्ड यू इन वन ऑफ द सेशन वेन एन एंगल इज मेड इन विथ सिचुएशन एंड एंगल इज मेड सो लेट इज डिस्कस वन क्वेश्चन हियर when one line is given and another line is joined by a line so at that time angle is created like this you can get the angle at any point like this it is made it is made like this only so these are the situation when angles are made what we simply need to do is to measure the angle with the help of the protector and write the measure in the box the box which is given down side we have to write the measurements in the box so students keep the protector with you keep the protector with you and i'll say that how you can measure the angle is that match this point of the protector this one where my point, pencil point you are looking about this point you have to match it out but two lines are meeting okay keep the protector down side okay keep the protector down side I have kept the protector here, students. You can clearly see. Now you have to follow this line, the blue line, where it is going. Now it is one thing is for sure, right side it is matching about. When the line matches with the right side, so then which measurements you will take into account is that the this line you are following. It means one thirty to one forty between this. The two lines are there. It means one thirty to one forty. It is one hundred and thirty five degree angle. Let's measure the next one, students. It shows it is an L shape. Without measurements, we'll get the measurement for this. It's a ninety degree, students. This is the ninety degree angle. So write ninety degree in this. Let's measure the third one. In that third one, measuring, you have to tilt a book a slightly, and then after, you can adjust your book like this, and you can keep it here. as i have kept here now this is matched with the left hand side students this is matched with the left hand side now when it is matched with the left hand side we'll see the upper side measurements upper side measurements it is showing between 70 to 80 it is 75 degree 75 degree measurement it is students we forgot it this angle so let us do this angle also so i'm keeping my book like this i'm tilting my book and i'm adjusting it i have adjusted it you can clearly see students that this point i have matched with this now this line is matching with the left hand side now it is matched with the left hand side you can see these measurements upside the upside it is showing upside measurement is 50 degree so this angle measures 50 degree students write 50 degree in this column this angle measurements you can keep your protector here and then after this line see where it is going it is between 40 to 50 this is 45 degree celsius this is 45 degree okay then next after no line is given it is a straight line and a semicircle is given here to mark the angle so keep a point here put your protector here okay see this line matches with the right hand side it is matched with and then after it is going to the left hand side so it is the 180 degree 180 degree is the angle and this we have already measured students let us do the next question number 18 the last question of the book look at the clock carefully and answer the following questions we have to answer the following questions by looking into the clock so students keep your protector here you can keep the protector here and then after see where the line is going it is going upside so it's a 90 degree angle students it is a 90 degree angle so what is the first question given what time does the clock show the time in the clock is 9 o'clock this is the 90 degree as we have measured which type of angle is formed by the hands of clock 90 degree in bracket you will write right angle right angle is formed 
Now a position is given students. What is the question if the clock shows 9.15? Which type of angle will be formed by the hands of the clock? If the clock shows 9.15, if in the clock the time is 9.15, so students what kind of the time it will show? Let's see I have drawn the clock here for 9.15. And I will take my protector and I will measure it out that what kind of angle it is showing. Put your point here. Match this line with this line. Students match this point with this line. Okay. And see this line is matched with here. It is 180 degree. So students this is showing 180 degree. This is the 180 degree angle. If the clock shows 2 o'clock of course. What type of angle will be formed by the hands of the clock? So when the time is 9.15, it is 180 degree angle. When the clock shows 2 o'clock, let's do the question here students. When the clock shows 2 o'clock, when it is showing 2 o'clock, what kind of angle it should be? So put your protector here and measure the kind of the angle. So students, it is showing 60 degree. Th this kind of angle is 60 degree this is 60 degree angle this is 60 degree angle so 60 degree angle will show when the time is there in the clock for 2 o'clock so students these are some of the questions what we have done now you have to do one thing in the homework the question which we have done now question number 18 and the question 17 you will write in the notebook as your part of the homework Thank you for today's session students, have a nice day.